Hey guys, welcome to another video on World Wide Crap, this time in English. And today I will present you Windows 8. As you can see, we are here in our Metro UI menu. This is our start screen. And we have all of, not all apps, but we can decide which apps we want to see. But we have a lot of apps here. And it is very organized and very elegant I think and of course you can switch from the Metro UI to the original desktop there it is and again back with the Windows key on the keyboard or with this kinda the new icon from Windows 8 okay so let me present some apps first of all Internet Explorer 10 completely new design we have this metro look, this um, bar on the button, button, and our pinned websites are here, and our recent pages or websites are here. So let's go back. And the cool thing about this, everything is on full screen. That's really cool. Okay, here we can start a new or add a new tab and and go back with the windows key let's look again on something i want to show you the benchmark of this browser it get um firefox 10 not firefox and then explorer 10 gets 3625 points on peacekeeper and yeah so let's another app treat rama that's the twitter app from uh, Microsoft and it's very clean, elegant, organized, very cool. Next app. We have the build app. Never tested that. Nope. Don't want to. Okay, piano. Nobody needs that. Come on, guys. Okay, we have some games here. Of course, you can organize these um, panels click hold some panel and drag it everywhere and for example here and now you can change the size of this panel you can make it smaller or you can make this one bigger or larger okay let's now let's go to the control panel this one is really new as you can see everything has changed and we have our notifications we can enable them or disable them okay and personalize of course change the lock screen picture and add some notifications on the lock screen and we can change our picture okay now let's get back to the metro UI okay and now we have paint play I don't, I think that's kind of the new paint it is poor as it has always been so very unuseful and yeah nothing changed okay the design but is still unuseful Go back. Okay, one of the cool thing is that we have kind of uh, multitasking. So let's start an app, for example, Internet Explorer. And now we can drag the app from here to the middle. And now we have two apps. Of course, we can maximize that or this or minimize. But yeah, if you have a Twitter app or something like that, you can watch your tweets and why that you can browsing or something like that. Let's go back and I'll to the desktop. So as you can see some little changes, but the biggest change is that we don't have our standard menu or start button. So if we click on this, you will get back but it's not 
now it's not working i don't know why but you get just a little yeah now you can see it we don't have our folder where our, our um, programs are programs and we don't have the list of apps or everything is changed we just have ser search share devices and settings and let's open search and here we are have our apps our complete list ah and here is paint the original nothing changed and as you can see in our Explorer we have the new um, UI this ribbon look that looks kind of creepy but okay some people like it some don't but okay and I think that was the biggest change the ribbon and this the menu menu but that's it they don't really change something in this desktop look everything is the same but for example our network connection you get this sidebar really cool and yeah they changed the theme the new allergen theme it's more rectangle and not rounded edges I really like it okay let's go back yeah for more videos on Windows 8 subscribe to our channel I will make a lot of new tutorials not a, just tutorials but also Windows 8 videos and of course some updates yeah if you like this video please comment it or favorite it or thumbs up I don't know peace out